Today, we release custom attributes for Divi 5, which allows you to add any attribute such as alt, title, rel, and area label to elements and sub-elements. Divi has had support for specific attributes such as class and ID, but now you can add any attribute to any element. This is especially important for accessibility, allowing you to, for example, add alt text to images and roles and labels to non-semantic elements like an icon-based button. Other attributes such as anchor link targets or data attributes for custom applications are also helpful. Let me show you how it works. You'll notice a new attributes option group in the advanced tab of all elements. Add an attribute, select a target element, and give it a name and a value. It's as simple as that. For example, I can provide this blurb image with some alt text. This icon, which serves as the close button for my interaction-based pop-up, can be given a role and an area label so that screen readers know what the button does. This new Attributes option group manages all attributes. The custom CSS and ID option group and the scattered attribute options in various modules have been migrated to this new attribute management system, which gives you complete control. Custom Attributes for Divi 5 is available today and is one of many features coming to Divi this year. We are pushing forward incredibly quickly, launching 18 new features in the past six months. This is the promise of Divi 5's new architecture. 2025 is the year of Divi 5. It's time for Divi to make its comeback. You can follow along as we progress through the final release of Divi 5 and beyond with updates every two weeks. You can use Divi 5 now to build new websites or wait until we add more features, whatever works best for you. We want you to try it, and if you love it, use it. When everyone loves it, we'll make it official. In case you missed it, we recently released three new modules for Divi 5, including the much-requested Group Carousel module, which allows you to create any type of carousel or slider. Unlike other carousels, each slide in the Group Carousel is a blank canvas. You can add any module to each slide. You control the number of slides, the content of the slides, and other animation settings. There's a link in the video description to learn more. Thanks for watching, and before you go, I have one favor to ask. If you're here for the Divi comeback, let us know by liking this video. It means a lot to see you cheering Divi on, and it's essential to feed the algorithm and spread the word. Don't forget to follow and subscribe so you never miss an update, and I'll see you soon for another Divi 5 feature announcement, which I promise is right around the corner.